You stay with us again tonight? You sick of me and all, yeah? I love you staying here. You can stay as long as you like. Tiffany does not know a good bloke when she sees one. What did you say to her? Don't matter. She's leaving. Right. Here. You go and buy her the biggest bunch of flowers. Yes, and tell her you're an idiot and you want her to stay. Listen, I'm buying no flowers. And, Gray, I don't want your money. You've earned it. You fixed my laptop. Take it. Come on, you saved me a packet. You like it, don't you? Tell him, Shen. Women appreciate a man who can show his feelings. That's right. Oh, are you not done? <laughs> you going in again with Grey tomorrow? I don't know, man. The office work ain't really a bit of me. You put in my tea. As if you met Toby. Ah, sandwich boy. He's brilliant, isn't he? He's making pee. Yeah. Like, he knew what he wanted and just did it. You don't need exams for that. And that's what I want. Oh, Richard Branson, watch out, eh? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> so there's not really much point in me going back to sixth form. Eh? Mm. Are you kidding? Good luck getting that one past mum and dad. Yeah, maybe you should break the news gently. What? Now? Look, we've just had mum's bombshell this week. You're going to go throwing a grenade in and He's a big boy, Shan. Fine. But when it all kicks off, you come straight back here. That's right. Hey, come here. Oh. Oh, do you have to? Yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> oi, oi. Savaloi. Savaloi? I didn't think you was into that anymore, oi. eh? Get... <laughs> <laughs> hey, son. You just in time. How was your day at the fun factory, eh? Hmm? Hey, have you seen Tiff today? Uh, only Sonia invited us all to her leave and do. Well, probably for the best, love. You know, draw a line. Yeah, plenty more fish with your chips, boy. Listen, I don't care about Tiff. I've, um, I've got something to tell you. Well, don't tell me that you're gay and all. Oh. Oh. Right. I'm not going back to sixth form in September. You never give it much of a chance, did you? If I walked out of every job I didn't like, then I'd never work a day in my life. Tell him no. I want to do something more hands-on. <laughs> what, like sweeping at the salon? You're always saying you've got to do what you want. Yeah, an office works boring. That's because your brother-in-law ain't exactly a very good advert, is he? The man too dry. What about your exam? Oh, this ain't nothing to do with you, is it? Listen, it's my life. It's your one life, son. What you want to mash oh, up I'll for? get work. What, without an A-level? Good luck on that, yeah? You ain't got none. I'm willing to take it from the horse's mouth. We know what we're talking about. Yeah, so what are you planning on doing, then? Well, the Grey said... Grey! Oh. Well, yeah, he said I've got to season him. I've got to take risks. See, that's why I can't stand men like him. What do you mean, like him? You see, men like him... Men like him, son, can afford to take risks, to dash for opportunities. Yeah, because, you see, where they're from, there's always something else around the corner. He knows someone that knows someone. But you see, me and your mother, we never had that, son. We want the best for our children, yeah? We want you to be better than us. No, I know that, but... But what? You see the exams you don't want to take? They could... That could make you a better man. That can get you out of here. Education, son, that's, that's a precious thing, like, like gold. Now, if you're going to let that slip through your fingers, you're going to suck that boy. At least he knows what he's talking about. Like, he's got the job, the car, the big house. You think he gives a damn about you? Or your future? Huh? This ain't got nothing to do with you, son. He's just doing this to get at me. You know what? what? You know what? It's about time I had a word with that backside grey. Now, Mitch. Right, just leave Mitch, it. Mitch, no. come on. Just that, calm down, no, little girl. Dad. Just leave me alone. That's not worth it. Please, just stop. Where'd you get her? You've got to stop Tiff leaving. This has been a long time coming. Will you listen to yourself? You're holding it over me like, like it's something special. What are you doing? Keegan, come and give me an hand. Hey. Mitch, no! Mitch, stop it! Hold up! Mitch, please! Dad, leave it! Open the door! Where your husband there? What? Why are you shouting? Where is he? Gray! Dad! I'm sorry, love. I tried my best. He's pig-headed. Me and your husband got some business. Where him there? There will be no shouting in this house. Do you understand me? I grew up with way too much of that. He kicked off when I told him I was going to leave sixth form. You ain't. Gray! Is there a problem? <laughs>